Hi beautiful people, good morning. <coughs> I think you can see that I'm pretty extreme with dates, like going on skydiving on a first date, going to Antwerp on a first date. So we made it to the place that we're going to eat. Let's cross before the car gets us. We now walk and it's raining so much. It's like a terrible weather. It got so cold outside. And then here is so beautiful. Something like this I think I'd really like to have in my um, mm -hmm. office. My name is Suji Nyanga. If you're new here and you don't know, that's my name. It is very early in the morning. Um, yeah, I had so much things to do. I went to sleep really late last night. I think like around three or so. Yeah, really late because I was, I, was, I, was, I was up talking and I went to sleep really late. But now we're on our way to go on a... The guy over there is watching me weird. I need to get used to talking to myself on camera in public and not caring what people think but okay we're not going to watch him <laughs> i'm now going to go um on a date and i'm meeting the person in the train and we're going to Antwerp. i think you can see that i'm pretty extreme with dates like going on skydiving on a first date going to Antwerp on a first date yeah it's pretty extreme it's such serious in me but honestly speaking like when i have to do these things like before it sounds like the most best idea and then when i have to do it like the day of i get really nervous and really like and everything feels like it's going wrong but okay like my hair i did it today and i thought okay let's do something different look cute and i'm not loving it but we're not going to worry with it we're going to have a good time we're going to meet someone that has good energy similar interests as me as well and have fun and i think my train's here so let's go and meet her soon <laughs> She's uh, living there. The closer I get there, the more I feel. Like, the more I feel like. It literally feels like you're going on a date. And even more excited because you've never met each other before and you're going to go so far and spend so much time together because. Yeah, you're going on a train. Oh my god. Anyway. I thought I'd come with a little update. So we made it to Belgium and she's not a catfish? <laughs> so we made it to the place that we're going to eat. Let's cross before the car. Gets us. I've seen this place always on Jennifer Ross's videos, and we're, fin Ooh, we're finally going to go. But we're now going to go into their chocolate museum. Purchasers of Belgian chocolate 
Luxembourg, Japan. Japan is really big. Oh, Poland. It's big. The United States. <laughs> Number one. Oh. How many? We're 20%. Oh, 20 percent Yeah, we love Belgium. That is hilarious. We love Belgium. We love Belgium. Yeah. So the thingy is really cool. We got these thingies that you kind of put into the air or like on a wall and you put it to your ear and it gives you a story like what you've just seen in the video which is really cool and actually quite interesting. Are they still talking? Yeah, they're still talking. <laughs> Take some pictures and relax here. And then here is so beautiful. Something like this, I think I'd really like to have in my um, mm -hmm. office. Mm. Kind of like book room area. I like the baskets on the wall. So every time you go to Africa, you get a new one. <laughs> I'm gonna go to Africa a lot. And they have like a like, selfie box where you can lift this. Oh, it's light. Oh. It's very light. It's very, very light. Mm -hmm. It's very light. Mm. <laughs> Where is this? To show how easy the work is. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> It's a very intense cacao body, creamy, caramelly notes, and less sugar. Okay. Less sugar. Mm -hmm. More chocolate, less sugar. Less sugar, more chocolate. No tasting. If you can bag, go. This I'm gonna have to make with some tea. Okay, so we have drinks. And we have pizza. Which one was this one again? The bu burrata, burrata yeah. margarita, and four cheeses. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
Goodbye, Antwerpen. Let's go. Dutch people be like, we are locked down. <laughs> We're not in lockdown. We're all coming to Belgium. Yay! <laughs> so that's the end of this vlog in Antwerpen. It was a really fun day. I came home after meeting some beautiful new people. Uh, connecting with like-minded people also having some very deep and meaningful conversations is always nice it makes my soul feel so alive we actually made one new friend while we went to that restaurant earlier in the day and we ended up having dinner with her uh, because she also lives in Holland so that was really nice to meet her and I just want to say thank you for watching this video I will be posting more of these also getting used to vlogging while out and until the next time I'll see you in my next video bye bye